They've been married for nearly 10 years. And on Wednesday, Sir Patrick Stewart, 81, and his wife Sonny Ozell, 43, looked sleek in classic black attire as they held hands at Dunhill's pre-BAFTA filmmakers' dinner in London. The iconic actor stepped out in a simple tuxedo, complete with crisp white shirt and black bow tie for the event at Dunhill House. Sunny oozed Hollywood glamour in her chic knee-length dress, which boasted a plunging neckline and voluminous off-the-shoulder sleeves. The Reno-born singer-songwriter styled her brunette dresses into waves and completed her flawless makeup look with a bright red lip. Patrick has been married three times and he met Sunny back in 2008 whilst filming Macbeth at Brooklyn Academy of Music. The Star Trek actor and Sonny tied the knot in 2013. He has two children, Daniel and Sophia, from his first marriage with Sheila Falconer, who he divorced in 1990 after 24 years of marriage. Earlier this month, Patrick acknowledged he contributed a voiceover in a Super Bowl ad for the forthcoming film Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, seemingly confirming he will appear in the movie. Speaking with Jake Stakes, the actor said that he received a big reaction when the clip featuring his voice was aired earlier this month during the game. Well, I had my phone turned off as it happened so I didn't hear anything," the veteran English actor said in the interview. He continued, It wasn't until the next morning when I woke up and looked at my phone and found that I had been bombarded with responses and that my PR people had sent me reactions that they had detailed and passed on to me. Stewart said in viewing the trailer, he actually didn't recognize his own voice as it sounded different. Whether I had a cold or something at the time, I don't know," Stewart said. But I was astonished, and all they saw was the back of my shoulder, and I think my earlobe, nothing else. There would have been so many connections made. But, uh, it pleased me. Stewart has a storied past with Marvel dating back decades, too, when he played the role of Professor Charles Xavier in 2000 film X Men. He has since reprised the role in 2003's X2, X Men United, and 2009's X Men Origins, Wolverine.